GST search on Manopatra. Under this feature, you can search for case laws on GST directly from the interface using various parameters like applicant respondent, judge's name, the relevant section, um, the disposition, as in if it was in the favor of the assessee or the respondent, um, the classification of GST, the date range, and more. It allows you to search on a specific field uh, from the above I just mentioned or a combination of fields relevant to the topic of GST. Uh, there are no mandatory fields and you can use any combination of multiple fields as you want. Um, this is how the interface looks like. Uh, I have uh, categorized all the fields on what you need to enter where. Again, these fields are all not mandatory and you can fill in only the information you have and uh, it would give you the relevant results from um, the judgments on GST. Now we look at this on the Manupatra website for a live demo. To access GST search, we'll go into legal search. Here you have the GST search tab, just select on this and the GST search would come. Um, now I'll enter a number of fields to show you how you can actually use it to get the most relevant judgment easily. Now in the apparent respondent field, I'll just enter state because in a lot of cases state is then judge I have a particular case in mind, so I know who the judge was. Even if I know the first name or the last name, it would give me an option from the drop down menu. Then I can select the act that I want to go for, or the, this is the list. You can select any act from here. Um, I can also select the section. So I have a section in mind on which I want the judgment from this particular act. So I'll just go and select that. Disposition, um, I want in the favor of SSE. So all this I've entered, I'll just enter what GST classification I want to show you that the entire list of GST goods and services is available here. You just need to select the tab and you can select what you're looking from for from the options given here. So nuclear reactors, boilers, machinery, etc. I won't enter the date. I The subject is already predefined as GST. Um, industry probably I could uh, mention. So I've done this. Now I'll run the search and it gives me the exact judgment that I'm looking for. Again, GST is a relevant uh, new act. So there are a limited number of judgments. And if you have any information of any of these fields, you can just enter them and get the exact result that you're looking for. To recap the feature uh, through this, you can restrict a research to GST alone. Um, you can search for judgments on GST using a specific field or a combination of fields. Uh, you can use multiple fields together and there are no mandatory fields required to be entered. I really hope this video was helpful to you in understanding GST search. Um, we also have a GST module, especially for indirect tax and um, people who work in the GST sphere, lawyers, company secretaries, chartered accountants. So if you want, you can check that out too. Uh, for any query, write to us at contact at manupatra.com or you can mention it in the comment section below and we'll get back to you. Thank you so much.